Immigrants who found themselves at the center of a political storm have been granted a rare form of legal protection. 49 migrants were flown to Martha's Vineyard from Texas with the assistance of Florida Governor Ron DeSantis' administration in 2022. Now a few have received special victims visas after claiming to be victims of a potential crime. Immigration attorney Rachel Self said the three have been granted bona fide determinations for their U visa applications, and she expects more to come in the future. The U visa process, intended for victims of qualifying crimes, has become an unexpected lifeline for these immigrants, allowing eligible individuals to work while awaiting a final decision on their petition. The development comes after an investigation by the Bear County Sheriff's Office. The department contends the migrants were victims of a crime and assisted in a law enforcement investigation. Despite DeSantis claiming the migrants boarded the flights voluntarily and legally. Sheriff Javier Salazar opened a criminal investigation, alleging the migrants were lured onto their flights under false pretenses. U visas are used for victims of a wide range of crimes, including domestic violence, sexual assault, human trafficking, and exploitation. They're specifically designed for people who have suffered mental or physical abuse and cooperated with authorities in the investigation. Even with the allegations, DeSantis has hinted at the possibility of flying more migrants to Martha's Vineyard, citing the ongoing humanitarian crisis in Haiti.